Well, hello, I'm the Rifter, and this is another tutorial, and it just happens to be on Google Sheets. Uh, at my job, I use these things a lot. Well, I don't use the second one a lot, but I use the first one and the last one a lot. But this is a tutorial on how to change the case of many, many cells in a Google Sheets document, which this is just an example. Uh, again, I deal with thousands and thousands, tens of thousands of names in one column. So it definitely helps me and hopefully it'll help some of you. But you see how you have this lump of crap here where you've got some lowercase names and some uppercase and they're all mixed together all willy-nilly because people don't care. Well, I'm going to show you how to fix that real simply. So if you've got a bunch of columns next to each other with important data, just right click up here on your letters and insert a column somewhere left, right, doesn't matter. In your blank created column, what you're going to type is equal. You're going to type lower parentheses a2 or whatever cell you are trying to convert and then press enter. Now you see it's got the orange around I just tried pointing at the screen with my finger. I don't know why you guys could follow along like that. It's got the orange around Nola Love, so that's the cell that you are going to convert to lowercase. Press enter and voila. And actually usually it gives me an option to autofill after that. I don't know why it didn't. But we got lower, I'll try this again, B2, and that, and enter. Oh, whoops. I was wondering what the hell happened. A3, and enter. So if it doesn't give you the autofill, there is another way to do it. So you've got your formula up there. What you do is copy that cell and just hold shift and press down until you get to the bottom there and press control V. And there you go. You have every single one of these names over here converted to lowercase over here. So my next move would be to copy this column and then come over here, press control shift V. And what that does is that just copies the values. It does not copy the formula. So if you wanted to copy this formula, you just copy that and then paste it over here and it didn't do anything because there's nothing in J. So don't worry about that. But then just delete your column that you aren't using or that, you know, you didn't need. But that formula was equal lower parentheses A2 or whichever cell you're trying to manipulate and then enter. So that is your formula for converting to lowercase. Now, converting to uppercase, which I don't know why you would need to, but it's here if you need it. Equal, upper, parentheses again. You want D2, parentheses, and enter. Now, it actually presented me with the autofill. I think I used the wrong enter key last time. Uh, don't use the key, don't use the enter key on your number pad. Use the regular enter key or return key if you're weird, call it a return key. Press control enter or click on the little check mark. And there you go. You've got this entire column in all caps and you did it very, very quickly. So I'm going to control C, control shift V, and then I'm going to get rid of that. Now, the very last thing I'll show you is how to get this converted to camel case or proper case. I would call it proper because camel case sounds weird. It's basically capitalizing the first letter of each word or name. So we're going to do equal uh, 
proper parentheses and we are at G2 or again whichever cell you're going to uh, manipulate enter or return whatever click the check mark or press control enter and there you go super easy to convert cases in Google Sheets now there is one little caveat uh, that this will not fix uh, a lot of Irish names or Scottish names I'm not sure which but uh, names like McKnight so it'll capitalize the first letter of the last name but it will not capitalize the K and I know sometimes it will be capital M lowercase C uh, capital K Sorry, you're just going to have to go in there and fix that. I haven't found a way to fix that yet, but hey, not a perfect world. But uh, again, that is how you do this. Forgot to write these up here, but it is equals upper and whichever cell. And then you're going to do equal proper and then whichever cell you're trying to convert. But that's it. You got lowercase, uppercase, and proper case. I hope this helped you guys. I mean, again, I deal with thousands, sometimes tens of thousands of names in a row. And rather than trying to check them all individually, I just give them a once over, let sheets do the work for me. And then I copy it and put it back on the column that it goes in because I don't have time to spend eight hours retyping names uh, but hopefully this helped some of you and hopefully you can use it at your work or if you just do things in spreadsheets like i do like your banking which is a lot easier in a spreadsheet than it is in your bank register but anyway uh over a thousand subscribers thank you as always uh, like share subscribe and i'll see you in the next tutorial thanks bye bye Hey.